Hi, my name is Charles and I'm one of the maths teachers from the Maxim Workshop. I'm just going to now teach you how to do some math. Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to calculate watts. Now watts is a um, measurement of power, so in, mainly in physics you'll come across um, the term of power and there's three basic ways how you can calculate it. Now power is denoted by P and in kinematics you have um, power calculated by the force multiplied by the velocity. Now in electricity within a circuit you might come across power being calculated by the voltage multiplied by the current. The last um, equation that you might use is when you find the energy and divide it by time. Now the one I'm going to show you how to calculate is the first one. So just to set up a small scenario where you might come across the calculation of power in kinematics is when you consider um, the motion of a car and its engine. So I'll just draw a car for you. engine here. Now just imagine if the engine of this car produces a, um, a force of possibly say 150 newtons. And then the velocity of the car equal to 5 meters per second. We want to now try to calculate the power associated with the motion of this car. So again, we have our force here equaling 150 newtons. And then we have our speed or velocity, which is five meters seconds. Now all we have to do is multiply the two terms together. So the easiest way I would do this is to think about five times 15, which is going to be um, 75. And then you have this 150, so the 10 there, which is uh, marked by the zero, you just multiply the 10 by the 75. And you get 750 units. And your units there are watts, so it's just denoted by a W. And that's how you calculate watts for power. <laughs> 